Hi, I got a bunch of stuff in the mail today, so I thought I would do a Etsy haul. I got some stuff from Mod Cloth, and then I got a Sephora order yesterday. From Sephora, I ended up getting the Tarte Blush in Glisten. And here's a little swatch. I wore it today, but I got ready at 3.30 this morning, so it's, it's lasted all right. You can still kind of see it, but that's the color. It's a very pretty color. It's glowy as well, and the, I got I have a lot of Sephora points, so they have the Sephora Outrageous Volume Mascara for 100 points, so I went ahead and got it since I never use my points since I'm so picky, and that's the brush. I use this today. I'm not impressed. I kind of regret getting this, but... Oh well. I also got the, this is from the Beauty Army Kit. This is the full size. This is the Cover FX Eye Prep Primer for under your eyes for concealer. And it comes like this. And it's kind of cool. I've never seen a tube like this. Um, it stands up like this. And then it has a little nozzle there. And you just need a tiny little dot for both of your under eyes. So this will last me a very, very long time. And I believe it was $45. It's a kind of expensive, but it's worth it to me. And on to my Etsy orders. Um, the first one is from Peachtree Lane. Her Etsy store is Peachtree LN on Etsy and it came in this cute box that has a tree stamped on it and here I got some pink studs roses and I'll take one of these off these are really cute and I think they're good quality it's a lot better quality than some of the other stuff I've seen on the internet but these are really cute the next one is from an Etsy seller. If you can't tell, I love Mickey Mouse. This is a Mickey Mouse ring. And it came with some earrings as well. I forget the seller's name. She didn't put it in the box, but I'll put it below. But those are cute. And the last Etsy, she wrapped it in a box. Lazo Flare. And she sent me a coupon to save 10% off my next purchase, which is nice. And I ordered these cute green post um, bow earrings. One of my favorite colors is green, and these are really cute. And all of these were pretty affordable. I don't think I paid over $12, $10 to $12 for everything. And from Mod Cloth, I was kind of mad. I ordered three dresses but one of them ended up being sold out and the website wasn't caught up so they sent me a 10% off coupon for next time but it comes in this cute box it says so now what will we do together no matter who you are or where you go we want you to know blah 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 and it has their website but I thought that was cute their shipping kinda takes a long time I ordered this I think it took a week and I got this free headband. I'll take it out of the packaging. It's just a terry cloth kind of braided orange. Wow, that looks pink on there, I think. But it's orange. It's kind of cute. And I got a braided dress that I saw on Pinterest. This brand is Gilly, G-I-L-L-I. -L -L -I. I thought it was cute. It got a lot of good reviews, and it has a keyhole kind of thing at the neck. It looks kind of sheer, though, so I'll definitely need a slip if I want to wear that out. And the last dress. I thought this was very Joan Mad Men-ish, so I had to have this dress. When she told me the one of the dresses was sold out, I actually thought it was this one. But 
This is brand, I can't say the name, but it's M-O-N-T-E-A-U. And it's just, it has a cute, I'll do an outfit of the day one day when I wear this, but it's a cute turtleneck kind of shift dress. And that is all for my purchases this week. I still have a few Etsy um, purchases coming, and I'll just do those next week. Thanks, and have a nice weekend.